students, welcome to IPB International Virtual Educational Creative Tutorial Room, Vector. This is our learning virtual classroom that provides you with encouraging virtual learning experience and accessible anytime, anywhere. In few minutes onwards, we will learn about communicate on the telephone. This unit deals with the competency required to communicate on the telephone in a range of settings within the hotel and travel industries workplace context. Today, we will show you about the element. First, respond to incoming telephone calls. Second, make telephone calls. In this video, we will share about how to respond the incoming telephone calls. Number one, answer calls properly. Number two, offer friendly assistance. Number three, repeat call details to the callers. Number four, answer callers properly. Number five, record and pass on caller requests. Number six, delay message accurately. Number seven, report suspicious phone call. Number eight, control your voice and voice. This video we will share also about making telephone calls. Number one, obtain correct telephone numbers. Number two, establish clearly the purpose of the call prior to calling. Number three, use telephone equipment correctly in order to establish contact. Number four, communicate clearly your name, company, and also reason for calling. And the last one is be polite and courteous at all times. All right, guys, you might still wondering how to communicate on the telephone. Let's, Let's check this video out. Answer the telephone within three rings. Good morning, Edward Boutique Resort, Aditya speaking. How may I assist you? Good morning. I'd like to talk to my friend. He is staying in this hotel. Certainly, sir. May I have your name and where do you come from? I am Lee Huang from Canada. Well, Mr. Wong, may I have your friend's name and his room number? He is Mr. John Sandals in room 101. All right, Mr. Wong, could you wait a moment? I connect your phone to Mr. Sandals. All right. Ask for the caller agreement before transferring the call. Good morning. John Sandals here. Who is this? Good morning, Mr. Sandals. I'm Aritya, the telephone operator. Your friends, Mr. Wong from Canada, wanted to call you. Would you like to receive your call? Oh, sure. Just put it in the line. Certainly, sir. I put you through. Okay, thank you. Thank you for waiting, Mr. Wong. Your phone has been connected to Mr. Sandals. Thank you. All right, thank you so much. Greetings with your work area, your name, and appropriate offer. Good morning, Edward Boutique Resort, Aritya speaking, how may I assist you? Good morning, um, this is Kim Lee and I would like to make a call to Mr. James Lee in the room 101, please. Certainly, Mr. Kim Lee, please wait a moment, I'll connect your call to Mr. Sandals. Okay, thank you. Always have pen and paper on hand to keep records. Thank you for waiting, Mr. Kim Lee. I do apologize because the line is engaged. Would you like to wait or leave a message? Oh, that's okay. Could you just tell him to attend the meeting in the restaurant tonight at 6 p.m. just before the dinner? Well, certainly, sir. But may I have your phone number before? Sure. So, this is my phone number. 085-792-141714 Alright, sir. Let me repeat your message that Mr. Sandal has to attend a meeting in a hotel restaurant at 6 p.m. tonight. And your phone number is... 081-792-141714 Is there anything else that, that I can help you? No, I think that's all. Thank you very much. Well, I'll pass on your message as soon as possible to Mr. Sandals. Thank you for calling and have a good day, Mr. Kim. Good morning, telephone operator. Aritya speaking. How may I help you? I would like to ask you, is it possible to call directly from my room to Japan? 
Certainly, sir. Your room telephone has been facilitated with international dial direct. You just have to press 9 to get the line out, followed by country code, city code, and phone number without first zero. Well, I'm afraid that I don't know the country code of Japan. Could you help me? Certainly, sir. Just to make sure, may I have your name and room number before? All right, it is John Sandals, room 101. Well, Mr. Sandals, Japan's country code is plus 81. But if you don't mind, would you like us to assist you with? I think I will make it tomorrow by myself. Thank you for the assistance. All right. For any further assistance, just dial O to a telephone operator. And also, we have special offer for you to have a wonderful Balinese Spa experience for tomorrow with only 115 US dollar. Would you like to take it? Hmm, that sounds tempting over, but I'm afraid that I think I cannot do that tomorrow. But thank you for the information. No worries, Mr. Sandals. Perhaps you can join us later. Thank you for calling and have a good day. All right, thank you. Good morning, Error Boutique Resort. Aritya speaking. How may I help you? Hi, Aritya. I got good news for everyone in your hotel. Well, I'm sorry, sir. May I have your name, please? And what's the good news will be? All right, just call me Thunder. The good news is your hotel will be explode in one hour. I just put a bomb in three spot in your hotel. People are gonna die. <laughs> Where may I know where's the bomb located, sir? Alright, so I will tell you the reason. Let me just interest this. I will give you a clue. Find two dudes like that before the hotel explodes. Why, sir? Why do you do that? <laughs> you don't need to talk that much, sweetheart. The one that you need to blame for this moment is your dudes. I do apologize, Mr. Thunder, but... May I have your location? And what's wrong with our hotel and GM to you? You want to me down? And you're the party there. <laughs> Complete the bomb threat checklist immediately. Good morning, telephone operator Aritya speaking. How may I help you? Good morning, Aritya. Chief security here. The bomb is found. Everything is under control. Everybody safe. Well, thank you so much for the good news. Here are some more tips for you. First, if you say you will call back, do as soon as possible. Second, politely ask his or her name if you are not sure the caller is a man or lady. Or you can say, how should I address you? Third, try to satisfy your guests with proper information. Next, do not answer the phone with merely say hello or yes. Next, do not make small noises during the conversation in the telephone. For example, scramble for pen and paper, eating, and talking to another person. Then, do not say he hasn't come yet, she hasn't come back from lunch yet, or he is in the toilet. And the last one, asking the caller to repeat the details is annoying. Well, IPB International student, today we have learned about communicating on the telephone. Thank you very much for watching and see you on the next video. Have a wonderful day!